Hi, Seth Shostak here at the SETI Institute. Now, in the news this week, you may have noticed, the Navy has admitted that those intriguing videos of strange objects seen in front of Navy jets about, what, 15 years ago are real. They have legitimized these videos. Now, what does that mean? They've, they've verified that these videos are videos. Now, that was never in doubt. Everybody assumed that the videos were videos. The Navy says, yes, they're real videos from the Navy pilot's craft. Many people are interpreting this announcement as saying that, well, not only are the videos real, but what they show are extraterrestrials who've taken the time and trouble to uh, get in front of some Navy jets and, you know, present themselves for you know, photographic scrutiny. Well, be skeptical, because, in fact, if you read the details of what actually these things uh, not only show, but how they were reported, it's all very self-contradictory, and so that's a little suspicious. But the main point is those Tic Tac videos. What could they be? Not that the videos are real, but what do the videos show? All right, I think a lot of you have seen them. There's kind of a gray background, and then you see these sort of this dark blob, which has been described as a, like a Tic Tac candy, more like a peanut if you ask me, but candies, peanuts, I mean, you know, you're talking parties in any case. This thing seems to be, I don't know, a strange object, and then it goes like that, right? Now, people are making the claims it's, it's flying out of the, flame, uh, the frame at a rate that's impossible for any aircraft that we know about. You know, what is this thing? It doesn't look like anything we've ever seen. It doesn't have, I don't know, windows on it. It doesn't have markings on it. It doesn't have rivets on it, whatever it doesn't have on it. Okay, here's my take. These are gun sight videos, that is, they're cameras that are, you know, connected with the gun sight of the, the craft, and they're designed to always, you know, look at the, in front of the airplane, but they're also infrared cameras. Infrared, you know about infrared, you probably have an infrared heat lamp down in the basement somewhere. Well, infrared is heat, and so what you're seeing in these videos, when you see something dark, that means it's something that's hot. The background's the sky, it's not all that hot, but whatever this Tic Tac thing is, it's very, very hot, and then it kind of rotates. Well, here's one possible explanation to consider for your next dinner table conversation about this, and that is that what they're actually seeing is a, a jet, a two-engine jet that might be, I don't know, a mile, 10 miles in front of the Navy jet, and you're just looking down the, the pipes, the exhaust of these two engines, and of course, they're hot, and so they, they, they show up as dark. And then when they rotate, well, that could be all sorts of things. That could be that the Navy pilot banked his plane a little bit, and so, of course, it looks like what he's aiming the camera at banks, or maybe the, the jet in front of him, if that's what it was, also banked. All right, all these are possible explanations. It's also possible that these are, you know, aliens that have come here and arranged things so that only the U.S. military can ever find them. And if you want to believe that, that's up to you. But I'm just telling you, none of the announcements of the past week have brought any new evidence to the question of, are we really being visited? And I'm willing to bet you next month's paycheck, admittedly not a big, big bet, but I'm willing to bet you next month's paycheck that we're not being visited.